uh, just an unbelievable uh, story because there were some pilots that flew over the area. They're from the uh, Idaho National Guard. A lieutenant in the, in the National Guard there uh, flew over this location, and uh, here's what it looked like from 9,000 uh, feet up in the air. You can clearly see just an unbelievable pattern. This is a Sri Yantra Mandela formation. Uh, it's an ancient uh, uh, symbol. And literally, this is a geometrically perfect uh, depiction of this ancient symbol. Uh, all the lines line up. Everything is correctly done. Now, these are the four border lines that go around the entire formation. And these lines are literally 10 inches wide and 3 inches deep. Every single line in this entire formation is 10 inches wide and 3 inches deep. So again, this is on hard pan desert type uh, dirt. So it's very compacted, very difficult to score into this type of material, especially a 10 inch trough that's three inches deep throughout this entire um, depiction here. So, uh, you know, who knows what made this? All we know is uh, a few things that we know about this. Number one, there was no cars uh, in this area. There's no tire marks into this area. It's in a very remote location. So it's out kind of in the middle of the nowhere. And all of a sudden, here you find this uh, incredibly huge uh, looking, uh, crop uh, circle looking type uh, of image in the middle of the desert. I mean, I've never seen this before. Uh, but again, this happened at a time uh, when, uh, you know, there was no kind of, of tools that you could use for this kind of a formation in 1990 uh, and pull this off in a very short period of time. I mean, this thing uh, had to have taken some time to be done uh, if it was humans making something like this. However, if there was something that was non-human that did this, that had some kind of higher technology, well, you might be able to carve something like this out of the desert uh, in no time at all because, uh, again, uh, the pilots hadn't seen this on the ground uh, as they flew over this area. And this is a training area where they fly planes over all the time uh, for the military. No one saw this. Just all of a sudden, August 10th rolls around, 1990, and these pilots fly over, and all of a sudden, whammo, there this thing is in the middle of the desert. Uh, but again, this was not done by humans. This is the biggest जो अमेरिका के अंदर स्थित है जिसके कारण विश्व में कोल्ड गेट से लेके कोल्ड ड्रिंक्स तक कोई भी चीज का इस्तेमाल होता है तो उसका आर्थिक फायदा श्री यंत्र के कारण अमेरिका को होता है श्री यंत्र के अंदर आदि लक्ष्मी धान्य लक्ष्मी धैर्य लक्ष्मी गज लक्ष्मी संतान लक्ष्मी विजय लक्ष्मी विद्या लक्ष्मी और धन लक्ष्मी का जो फायदा मिलता है तो आज पूरे विश्व के अंदर किसी को भी अभ्यास करना है तो अमेरिका जाना पड़ता है स्पेस टेक्नोलॉजी में कोई रिसर्च होता है तो भी उसमें यूएसए का नाम आता है ये श्री यंत्र के कारण उनकी आर्थिक संपन्नता है मगर आज तक किसी को मालूम नहीं था जब हिंदुस्तान के अंदर कोई यंत्र की पूजा होती है तो उसको अंधश्रद्धा के नज़र से देखा जाता है किंतु ये अंधश्रद्धा नहीं है ये हमारे ऋषि मुनियों का विज्ञान ही है और विज्ञान के कारण हम ब्रह्मांड के साथ हमारे मंत्रों के माध्यम से जुड़ सकते हैं और इसलिए मैं जो नई जनरेशन है उनको नम्र निवेदन करता हूं कि हमारे संस्कृति के साथ जुड़े हुए कोई भी यज्ञ परंपरा है या मंत्र परंपरा है उसकी हंसी या मजाक मत कीजिए उसके पहले अभ्यास कीजिए क्योंकि विश्व में काफ़ी ऐसे देश है जो हिंदू संस्कृति के ऊपर उनका निर्भर है और उनके ऊपर ये रिसर्च करते हैं तो पहले उसको स्वीकारें और विज्ञान की दृष्टि से धर्म की प्राप्ति करें तभी हम धर्म को समझ पाएंगे और तभी पूरे मनुष्य जाति से का हम कल्याण कर सकते हैं अस्तु वंदे गोमात्रम विरल बापू मौज